Hi, and welcome back for another episode of 40-something Gay here on SomeLikeIt'sGot.com. This week I want to talk about how badly I think that we need a gay male power couple in Hollywood. Now, I'm not talking about behind-the-scenes gay male couple, because I'm sure there are plenty. As we all know, the gay mafia supposedly run Hollywood. And I'm not talking about lesbians, because we've got our Kelly and Rosie and Ellen and Portia, and the problem with those being our top gay people represented in the media is that the white straight men who still run this country still have a kind of fantasy about two women together. Whereas two men together, we all know a lot of straight men aren't going to admit that. Well, unless you're a politician in a bathroom tapping like Gregory Hines. But that's a topic for another day. No. I want to see us get a gay power couple in Hollywood that walks the red carpet hand in hand. That's what we need in order to gain the acceptance that we're looking for. Let's face it, the more desensitized that America comes to seeing two men together, the better off it's going to be for all of us and the better chance we're going to have to actually get marriage passed. Now, I've been with the same person for a thousand years, and I'd like to be able to see that in the media as well. The problem with us gays is that the ones who get outed in Hollywood always stay single. And don't even start to talk to me about Lance Bass and how he came out and had a boyfriend. Because as we all know, Lance Bass really doesn't count. And the reason he doesn't count is because really nobody wants to sleep with him. Men, women, animal, Mullinex blenders. Uh, I can't think of anybody who'd want to sleep with him unless they're sleeping with him to say, Hey, could you talk like Justin Timberlake? Could you tell me what he's really like? That's really the only reason anyone's sleeping with Lance Bass, besides the fact that now Lance Bass has a book which no one's going to read! But anyway, my point is, is that what we really need is a Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie of our own. And I'm not saying that they have to go all out and adopt children from Africa, but I'm not saying it would hurt either. The thing is, is that we've proven time and time again that as gays started out in the media and on TV, they were represented as foppish, flaming queens. And so it was, they were very funny to look at. Then we kind of moved into that next level, where gays were on TV and they were all single and just sluts like they are on normal TV now. But what I really think we need is a power couple that walks that red carpet, that comes into America's home and we ask them, what are you wearing tonight? What did George say when you got dressed tonight, Matt Damon? That kind of a couple, that stature, a George Clooney and a Matt Damon together. And I'm not strictly talking from a fantasy kind of thing, guys, which... Go ahead, have your fantasy. Who am I to say who you fantasize about? No, I'm talking about that's what we need to move us gays forward in Hollywood. We need a gay mega power couple. A gay mega male power couple is what we need. So, all of you stars in Hollywood who are thinking of coming out, who are out already, here's my plea to you. Don't date somebody that nobody's ever heard of before, and don't just date somebody for five minutes. No, we need a long-lasting power couple, okay? We need a couple to stay together, and we need you gays to be um, in the gay stratosphere. I think it would help all of us to get closer to being accepted by America at large and getting being able to have the rights to get married and everything else. So, TR Knight, we've got our eye on you. You're a little bit of a possibility. You're not that great of an actor, you're not that big of a star yet, but we'll keep our eye on you. But I'm sure there are others of you out there. So... What I'd like you to do is go out, made up, and make sure it's somebody that's noteworthy. All right? So, thank you for watching another episode of 40-something Gay here on SomeLikeIt'sGot.com. Join me every week for episodes of 40-something Gay and at the website SomeLikeIt'sGot.com for tons of fun stuff to read, listen to, and watch. Have a great week. Are you okay, old friend? Are we all...